Hello everybody, I'm Prophet Sidra and today we're back with Sepia Tears. So uh let's just get straight into this. As you can see there's another save file there, because this is my second recording. But either way, let's just jump in. <sighs> Here we go. Oh, me, Chad. <laughs> I don't like it. Yeah, the developers. Okay. Dots. Oh, me, Chad. Are you up? Of course I'm up now. That sounds familiar. Of course it does. Mark, we're gonna be late. Yes. I know. Ah! Of course, they don't really know uh, what I do. That's a good one. Hey, are you even listening to me? Uh, yeah, yeah, I heard you. Of course you did. Jeez, it wouldn't kill you to be a little more gentle. Gentle? <laughs> gentle, but I'm your cute little sister. I'm automatically gentle. <laughs> That's like saying I'm automatically dependable because I'm your older brother. Wait. See? If you're not the dependable sibling you're supposed to be, I give you the legal right to find new and exciting ways to tease you. And was it that right this law? More importantly, I have a history test this morning, so I'll leave you behind if I have to. Pouting, my diligently evil little sister runs down the stairs. Can you find a normal remote form of torture? What do you call normal for torture? Ah. <sighs> uh, this visual novel and its two letter noises. It's right out. Pleasantly bright. They're having people going in their mouth, so it's good. They make that too easy. I can get lost just looking at the pale blue sky, although I fear the cold that accompanies it. See, this is why I hate winter, and I love winter. This main character, I don't. This protagonist, I don't know. Anyway. Nature has no mercy for the northern hemisphere. Actually, does that make a difference? Technically, every country has to be part of a hemisphere. So, there must be warm regions in the northern hemisphere. Even so, the southern hemisphere would be... Stop talking! Mark, uh, I've been working on my... Kotoko Shinken, and... I'm coming, I'm coming! The last time she tried this. <laughs> I can't help but laugh. That's just absolutely hilarious. And at least I can see what I look like right about. Ugh. I'm gonna make it still over the camera. Yeah, yeah. Down there. You can you can see what I'm what I'm talking about. I shudder to think of it. I'm pretty sure I know who my next practice subject is going to be. If you make me fail my test. <laughs> Isn't it usually practice partner, not practice subject? Not in her case. So that's my sister, Rina. Since she started my... Oh, since she started at my school, life has been hell. Well, maybe that's an exaggeration. She's a nice girl a lot. She takes care of me, she makes me lunch, and forces me to buy her stuff. Eh, see what I mean? I'm already out of compliment. I'm out of compliment, already. And that threat certainly wasn't the first. Ouch! Stupid razor. <laughs> that was supposed to be show that. It's supposed to show me how to use it. Pretty easy. Anyway, 
Then it is the fridge floor. Put it like she always rattles on about these crazy robot wars and melodramatic love stories that she watches, trying to find new and exciting <laughs> ways to pull me into her world. I haven't figured out why she calls me a new chat yet, though. And according to that of the name Mark, I believe this is set in America. Because, if you guys don't know, Nichan means Big Brother in Japanese. It's short phrase. It could also be Adiku. I believe it's so. Adiku. Yeah, Adiku. Is it ironic? Ironically unironic. Ironic because she thinks all oh, think it's suddenly ironically un ironic. What's with all the unironic stuff? Or ironic. Uh, I can only conclude that it's part of some devious scheme that I have yet to catch with. The tip of the iceberg, so to speak, if the iceberg were a bloody rose in the but as much as I'd like to criticize her, I can't complain. She still does better than the next two of us. Alright, I'm all done. Oh, and she also does a better job of pushing than Buggy. And she never sleeps in, and the only time she's late to class is when I hit a nap. Now, do you see my life, my life with her? Uh, <laughs> yes, I do. Good morning, did you sleep well? I slept perfectly fine until I was awoken by a certain someone. <laughs> How could you say that? Um, easily. I speak words. <laughs> you should be thankful you have a cute girl like me to wake you up every morning. You're not supposed to call yourself cute. <laughs> Is that because we're blood related and you're a fr That's not why! I mean, it's a little vague, don't you think? And it's not very cute. I've been there for sure. Sad. Sad. Anyways, the one time I'm only doing it to unnerve you. It makes a lot of sense. Yep, yeah, good boy. Well, I do have to thank you for keeping me on my toes all the time. You're like my mother, is what I wanted to say. But I imagined her twitching smile and my life flashing with the laugh. So, Ren, you have a test this morning? Yep, I did a quick review with my friends yesterday, so you don't need to worry about it. I wasn't worried. And the stars. Aw, oh, is that your way of hiding your affection? Nope. Was that even remotely implied? I'm sure you'll pass the test. I just want to make sure you don't forget anything that ends up saying for some stupid reason. Like that accident. Like that time I accidentally brought my Game Boy instead of my calculator? Yep. Yes. Yes. Like that time. I was only 12. It was, it was an innocent mistake. Only 12. <laughs> Regardless, you get what I'm saying. Record the Game Boy. Just screw up. Just don't screw up. <laughs> Just screw up! Screw up all of it. Just all of it. Just screw up. Good reading. I know, I won't. But aren't your exams coming up as well? Uh oh. I'm gonna go over to my to Lucas's house and study over the weekend. I wanna see this Lucas. He looks pretty cool. He seems pretty cool. Or something like that. <laughs> Even for you, that's not a very convincing lie. Psychic! She's psychic. But I did make that up on the spot. I wouldn't kill you to have a bit of faith in you. I said, if I said I'll study, I'll study. Really? You'll spend your whole Saturday afternoon doing math problems and reading your social science notes? I'm tempted to say what notes, but that really isn't the problem here. <laughs> well, would you look at the time? <laughs> Don't change the subject. I, we're already late. Well then, we have to continue at lunch, right, Onicha? <sighs> that smile is so much more endearing before you get to bed. 
very much so. Made it! I leap past the front door as the clock strikes eight o'clock, inhaling a lungful of December air. It's December here too, yay! As you can tell, I'm in a pretty chair. I love pretty chairs. Not bad, Mark. Not bad at all. You were taking so long with your bag that I thought I'd really have to put the gloves on. I thought you were going to leave me behind if I took too long. I was only kidding! Really? Really? Leave my only brother alone to watch the school on such a cold, cold day? I couldn't. I could. <laughs> and yet, you can practice your anime fighting techniques on me. Well, when you look at it that way... There's the fire! But you know mastery of the martial arts can be very... can be extremely important. Sorry, I have some stuff to know dollars. So, this sounds kind of weird, so... Uh, what does that have to do with anything? It's important, really! Yeah, yeah, I know. Self-defense and all that. It's not just self-defense. It's an extra weapon in your arsenal. What? <laughs> okay, picture this. Vrin Sensei! <laughs> Imagine that you're fighting against an enemy who already knows your technique. That looks a lot like an anime character I already know. I'll put future me might if I can find the picture and if I can actually edit because I don't know how to edit very well but if I can I'll put a picture somewhere on the screen of that of a character that looks kind of like that. Um of course it, ugh. It might be difficult for me to find, but seriously, hold on a minute. Okay. Because the person you challenge because the person challenged you because he kidnapped the princess, use your imagination. But what happens if the princess is another cat? Then you just have to go look for her. I'm guessing that he was gonna say castle. Ouch. Anyway, let's say you're, let's say you end up in a combat, in combat with someone who knows that you're good with long range weapons, like a crossbow. They already know your weakness, all they have to do is dash forward and fight at a closer range. An archer won't be able to react fast enough, and the attacker will have the event. But what if you're using a mid-range weapon like a lance? A lance, that's easy. A well-trained warrior would be proficient with both bows and axes. And everyone knows that the axe beats the legs. Sure, but then you, you couldn't you just learn magic and attack from the distance? Yes, but if your enemy knows that you're a magician, the what if game. A skilled axe wielder would eliminate you with a single strike, no critical necessary. Every magician needs an ace of And that ace is martial arts? Oh, that also looks like an anime character. Except for that one, I know. There's two characters that look like that. Uh, Konota from Lucky Star and Minimi from Achikochi. I'll put both of the pictures somewhere if I can edit it. Once again. Oh, me. Yeah. That way. <laughs> That's one option. You see, magicians draw their power internally, not externally. Oh. My. That is long. Unlike magic, unlike sorcery, flows through in a natural... Flows, uh, flows through a natural internal circuit before it can be used in the form of spell. The use of these circuits can drain much of an amateur's magical energy, resulting in the weakening of the magu... magus... magus... I'm, I'm not sure... <laughs> come out ability. In this, scenario, in this scenario, the trained magus would be susceptible to the attacks of an ordinary human. More so if said human is skilled in hand-to-hand -hand combat, 
though it's an unlikely scenario, it would be good for Magic to enough with the info dump. Uh, oh, enough with the info dump. Fine, I don't need you. She taps the Twitter icon on her phone and runs away. Why Twitter? I don't know why Twitter, but Twitter. Okay. Okay, I may have been a bit hard on her back then. You call that hard on her? Really? But this isn't about bad outcome either. You'd think the streets would be a little bit more busy in the morning, but no. Oh, no. But no one ever passes by here. It's hard to get used to it. Used to. Oh, it's hard to get used to if you're from the city. But I've lived in the suburbs my whole life, and I like to keep in quiet. Well, that's good. It's nice. Let's do my wander. Whoa, what was that? The dots, the dots, the dots, the dots. Let's do mind wandering the things you'd rather avoid. Well, then, don't think about it. Mark. What? Huh? Yeah. What? What was that? What was that? Oh. Hi. I saw you there. I look around momentarily and spot a figure. But it disappears before my eyes. Huh. Hey, she looks familiar. Really? Did she look familiar to Mark? You can't be that important. Nah, I don't think so. Two weeks later, I would look back on that moment as the first in a series of very, very silly assumptions. Hey! Hey, it's Lucas! Mark, you're actually early. Let's give him that voice. Mark, you're actually early. I like that voice. I think that's cool. Alright, well, I like this here. I think I'm gonna save right here. And also in the video here. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you like, please like, comment, subscribe. And I will see all of you awesome people in the next video. See ya.